The question of why Allah created the world is a profound one and has been contemplated by theologians, philosophers, and scholars throughout history. In Islam, the primary purpose of creation is often understood in the context of divine wisdom and the will of Allah. One central concept in Islam is the idea that Allah created human beings and the world to worship and serve Him. The Quran mentions this purpose explicitly, I did not create the jinn and mankind except to worship me. Worship in Islam encompasses not only formal acts of prayer, but also living a righteous life in accordance with the guidance provided by Allah. The creation of the world is seen as an expression of Allah's attributes, such as His creativity, wisdom, and mercy. Through the diversity and complexity of the universe, believers are encouraged to reflect on the greatness of Allah. Life on earth is considered a test for human beings. Allah created humans with free will, allowing them to make choices between right and wrong. The experiences in this world serve as a test, and individuals are accountable for their deeds in the afterlife. Allah's act of creation is often seen as an expression of His mercy. The opportunity for repentance and forgiveness is provided to human beings, emphasizing Allah's compassionate nature. In Islam, humans are considered stewards, khalifa, of the earth. They are entrusted with the responsibility of caring for the environment and maintaining justice and righteousness. The creation of the world serves as a demonstration of Allah's sovereignty. It is a reminder for human beings to recognize the oneness of Allah and submit to His will. While these are some key aspects, it's essential to note that the wisdom of Allah's actions is beyond full human comprehension. The Quran acknowledges this in various verses, reminding believers that they have limited knowledge and understanding, but they will never encompass anything of His knowledge except that which He wills. In summary, the creation of the world in Islam is intricately tied to the concepts of worship, divine attributes, accountability, mercy, stewardship, and the recognition of Allah's sovereignty.